Hey everybody, it's Nick. Uh, just gonna show you a really quick tutorial on uh, how to add a uh, like a looping background sound um, into your uh, like Unity AR app. Uh, started off with a blank scene. Just go to a new scene, and uh, as we usually do when you're doing AR, go ahead and get rid of the main camera, and then you're gonna add an AR session origin, add an AR session, and then uh, you can attach a sound to to kind of if you if you wanted to, you could actually just probably make a blank. Uh, game object and um, rename it. Just call this like background uh, sound. Then um, I think it helps to uh, go into your assets folder and go ahead and make a sound or sounds folder. And into that, you can go ahead and take. Uh, you need to have a wave file, and if you need help converting that, you can probably find some 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 utilities online or some tutorials about how to convert that sound. I'm not going to get into that right now, but I've got this uh, cricket sound, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and place that into the sounds folder. It's going to copy, and you can you can see that there, and um, you should just be able to play it, and that's it. So that's actually just just going to be in that folder. Um, then uh, you go into the background sound and you add a component. Um, we're just going to add an audio source. And we're going to drag our clip into the audio clip right here. And you can just say play on awake and then loop. And when you actually compile the app and play it, you're going to get that cricket sound in the background. Okay. So that's all you need to do to get that if you just want a background sound. Um, just pay attention to the volume of it. You know, you can you can actually change some of those parameters here um, as you as you kind of build it. But that's pretty much all you need to do. Um, you don't you don't need to actually call it in the script or anything. If all you want it to be is just something that's in the background. Um, if you want to trigger that sound, I'm going to show you that in another video. But this is just how to have some kind of audio background. So it could be some kind of ambient noise, or it could be some kind of music. Uh, but that's actually all that you uh, that you actually need. I'm going to try to play it and see if it shows up. It might not it might not show up because it's not ar okay anyway in any case that's pretty much all that you need at this point all right uh hope that helps i'll uh, talk to you later